12 News is your hurricane headquarters, and many of you probably remember this. 6 to 10, even 12 hours of sitting in traffic waiting to evacuate on the heels of a hurricane. Unfortunately, this is a reality Southeast Texans face. Well, now TaxDOT is looking to help make the evacuation process go a lot smoother, and they're hoping to build a new evacuation route along Highway 69. This new road will be called the 69 Lumberton Coons Relief Route, and it'll stretch over 20 miles. All right, 12 News reporter Kayla Chote spoke with TaxDOT to see how you can help choose the new evacuation route. Kayla? Thanks, Gloria, Brenda. Packing your family, pets, clothing, food, all into one car just to get stuck in traffic for hours is still a fresh memory for many. TxDOT wants your help and your input on where they should put this new road. It was very putt-putt going. You know, people were stopping and going. You know, we didn't get very far at all at, at any particular time. Don Singleton is a Beaumont resident for 36 years. For Hurricane Rita, she, along with her daughter, two-week-old grandbaby, and four children, were stuck on the road trying to evacuate. Hurricane Rita was one uh, where we had to go to Lufkin. It took about 12 hours to get to Lufkin when it should be about two hours. Um, it was very congested. Um, I worry about that now, being that 69 has pretty much got all that construction going on. But relief could be on the way. TxDOT is working hard to create a new evacuation route just west of Highway 69 that will stretch from Cooks Lake Road northbound toward FM 1003, a relief for growing congestion in the area. This segment is very important for hurricane evacuation. It's also very important for freight movement. And so the Lumberton, the Coons area, they're both getting um, very congested. This is going to be a completely different roadway. This is going to be a um, relief route around Lumberton, around Coons, and it's going to be a controlled access. TxDOT wants your input to help choose their new roadway route, which you can do through their interactive map. We're looking at several different alignments, so we need people to go online and let us know how they feel about that, um, whether you might have property in that area, whether you might travel that area, um, whether, whatever it may be, uh, drop those pins, let us know uh, your comments about that that proposed alignment. This project is expected to start construction by 2035. If you want to ask your questions to TxDOT, they will have two public in-person meetings, one in Lumberton on May 2nd and the other in Coons on May 4th, both from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. In studio, Kayla Chote, 12 News.